how to create a digital menu for your restaurant. Hello, happy to have you here. Let's learn how to create a digital menu for your restaurant for smoother business operations with less effort and manpower. Come on. Here's how you create your restaurant's digital menu with Menu Tiger. Log in to your Menu Tiger account. Once you see your dashboard, click on Menu. There, you'll see two options, Foods and Modifiers. Under Foods is where you add your dishes and under Modifiers is where you put the add-ons and side dishes for each category and food items. To get started on digitizing your menu, click Foods. This is where you get creative in showcasing your menu. Click on the new button beside categories. Start filling in the boxes by choosing the store and writing down the name of the food category. We're gonna come back and add something under modifier groups later. For now, we're gonna continue and click add. You can add as many categories as you want. Now that we've created a food category, add the food items under that category. Click on a category, then click on the new button beside food list. Fill in the store, name of the dish, then its description, price, size, and preparation time. If the food item is a featured dish, tick the box beside featured. Availability is already ticked by default, but you can untick it if the dish becomes unavailable or will be off the menu for a bit. If the dish has food allergens, you can list it down under ingredient warnings. If the dish has add-ons, you can add it on modifier groups after you've made a modifier group for the add-ons. Adding modifier groups is discussed in the later part of the video. You can then add up up to three appetizing photos of your dish by dragging and dropping it on this box. You can add recommended items later after you've added all the dishes on your food list, review the information you filled in, then click add after you're done. Repeat the process until you've added all of your dishes. Now, let's proceed to modifiers. This function is for giving your customers some options on what they want to add with the dish that they're ordering. For example, a salads category would need a variety of meats and salad dressings for customers to choose from. To add those options, click on modifiers, then click on add, then fill in the name of the food modification. It can be a side dish, a modification on the order, or an add-on. Put in food modifications by clicking on add. Fill in the name, price, and unit. You can click on the toggle button to enable or disable a modifier item. Once you're done, you can click the save button. Repeat until you've added all of your food modifications. So after you're done adding all of your modifiers, Go back to Foods and select a category that has modifiers. Click on the Edit icon, then click on the drop-down menu beside Modifier Groups to add the modifiers and click Save After. Aside from modifiers for a category, you can also add a modifier that's specific to one dish. Just create the modifier group in the Modifier tab. After creating the modifier group, Go back to the dish and click the edit icon, then select the modifier under Modifier Groups. Make sure to click Save after you're done to save the edits that you made. If you want to delete a dish, a category, or modifier group, click the Delete icon, then Confirm by clicking Yes, Delete. You can also rearrange the order of your food categories. Just long press on the category, then drag and place it on where you want it to be. This is to adjust the order of how the categories will appear on your online menu. Now that you're done with adding and editing your digital menu, you'd wanna see how it looks, right? Well, you can do that by clicking on the preview icon located on the upper right corner. Once you click it, a pop-up window will appear and it will show you a sneak peek on how your digital menu looks like. This will help you determine whether you have to do edits or not. Sign up now and get a 14-day free trial powered by Menu Tiger, elevating customer and business experience using Menu QR code.